So a lot of us in the XRP army are just hodling this coin without earning any interest on it. And there are in fact ways to stake your XRP to earn passive income. And I've said it before and I'll say it again, you should really have two separate bags of XRP, one for long-term hodling and the other for swing trading. And I'm gonna get into the opportunity for staking your XRP, which is something the XRP army can finally do. Of course, I'd like to give a quick overview of what staking is exactly, and The Motley Fool does a good job of this. Now, staking cryptocurrencies is a process that involves committing your crypto assets to support a blockchain network and confirm transactions. With cryptocurrencies, they use the proof-of-stake model. Staking is a way transactions are added to the blockchain. First, participants pledge their coins to the cryptocurrency protocol. From those participants, the protocol chooses validators to confirm blocks of transactions. Now, the more coins you pledge, the more likely you're to be chosen as a validator. So every time a block is added to the new blockchain, cryptocurrency coins are minted and distributed as staking rewards the block's validator. And finally, that is when re you receive your passive income. So it's that simple. Okay, so where can you stake XRP right now? Well, the exchange Nexo allows you to stake XRP at actually a really good rate. Now, I've got Nexo pulled up here, but it's a reputable exchange. It's been around for years. They've also got some other staking coins on here as well with solid rewards, as you can see. I think they've got like 30 coins in total. Uh, of course, you guys want to learn more about Nexo. We will have some resource links in the description going over specifics on how you get paid here as well. I'd also like to throw out there, to the XRP army, I want to give a shout out because I've finally accumulated a little over 200k coins of XRP. And it's crazy because I've been stacking this coin for so many years. I remember the days when I was trying to hit that 100k mark, but hey, you know, it happened. Uh, I'd also like to recommend to any of you currently still buying XRP, really anything under $1 is a good long term buy, in my opinion, because I think XRP is going to get to the $10 mark and beyond. So, you know, still looking at uh, a 10x plus return, just averaging under a dollar. And honestly, when it gets to 10 bucks, um, I'm hoping, you know, in the next year or two, uh, if not sooner, I think that who knows how high it can go, really. Now, I'd also like to wrap things up going over a couple of other staking exchanges that while don't offer XRP are still solid if you, you know, own some large cap cryptos like Ethereum, Solana, Polkadot, and a few others such as BlockFi. Now I've got BlockFi pulled up here because I've been using them for a couple of years. And basically, you know, uh, they've got Ethereum on here, Dogecoin, which is a coin you actually can't find too often for staking, Uniswap, which is another one I like, and, you know, the basic attention token. Uh, the cool thing about BlockFi is they pay you on a monthly basis. You could have the coins reinvest into the ones you're already staking, or you could have it go into cash. You know, the other thing about staking, guys, is it really is very similar to how in the stock market you get these dividend payments. Um, dividend stocks, though, don't always pay you on a weekly or monthly basis. Um, actually, I don't think they do weekly. It, I think the best you can find in the stock market is on a monthly basis. Uh, but with staking, you know, it can be anywhere from like a week to a month. It really just depends. Okay, and then Uphold is another exchange that you could stake some good coins. You know, you got like Solana, Ethereum, Cardano, um, Tron, you got some other coins here as well. So just to kind of like bring this all home to you guys, uh, really staking, whether it's XRP or any other coin, it is a long-term strategy. So you got to be thinking, you know, two to five years out. Um, and the reason you want to do that is because you don't have to worry about like the week to week and month to month volatility of your coins. You know, if you hold a lot of these staking coins long enough, especially the large cap cryptos, you're not only going to get these uh, payments, these staking payments, but you're going to get the the coin price appreciation, you know, that's just going to compound over the years. So it's really like, uh, it's pretty awesome. So yeah, I mean, staking XRP guys, you know, obviously Nexo, take a look at them. Um, anyways, if you have any questions specifically, you know, about staking, you could always message me below in the comments. And I actually want to give a price prediction for where I see XRP getting, you know, in the next 18 months. And really looking where it's at right now, you know, it's been hovering under 50 cents. Uh, I think that we are going to get back up to the dollar point very soon. And then when we get past a dollar, you know, I'm thinking it's going to take a few months. Uh, I'm, I'm going to go with six months after it hits a dollar for it to creep up to $2.50 to $3. I think once the SEC lawsuit is over and, you know, we start to get some more traction with uh, XRP, 
I think that it's going to break its old all-time highs, which are in the the $3 range. And then after that, you know, I'm hoping we get that moonshot to 10 to 12 bucks. Okay, anyways, as always, thanks for watching this, guys, and we'll see y'all in the next crypto video.